Ah, oh, shit. Here we go again. Everybody, what we going? It's home, man. It's your boy Q, aka Uncle Quan. Welcome back to the shit show, y'all. But this time we got a wet shit show. <laughs> we got a wet shit show, y'all. It's about to be real nasty. It's about to be an ugly game. And yet my dumb ass is right back out here, man. <laughs> tickets was very cheap. The tickets was going for like $10, maybe $12, something like that, man. Dumb cheap. Don't nobody want to be out here watching the Panthers fuck it up in the rain and literally just watching misery happen right in front of us. <laughs> Shout out to my dudes, man. I actually got some really good tickets. I ain't have to pay shit. She sent me and my brother out here, man. I'm out here with my brother. So we about to go out here and see what it, oh, I guess we about to, you know, it's something to do, you know? <laughs> it's something to do, I guess. <laughs> but family, it's literally been a shit show since week one. Obviously I was out there week one watching the Falcons. So it was a priority for me to come to this game to see like a revenge game. But who saw us being this ass at this point in the season, man? So. <laughs> Uh, I mean, it is what it is, uh, but it's literally been insanity since week one, y'all. We've been watching literal, by definition, insanity. We've been seeing very vanilla play calling from our, our offense. We've done seen our damn coach get fired because of the vanilla scheme. And now we're still dealing with that vanilla offense from our offensive coordinator, Thomas Brown. And uh, it's just, we're not seeing anything different. We're seeing a young quarterback struggling in the system. We're seeing an offensive line that can't protect a young quarterback. We're seeing receivers that can't really help out the young quarterback with separation, that dropping the ball. It's just, it's bad all around. Hell, even our young quarterback is struggling with mechanics here and there. It's just shit show all around on offense, man. So it's been the same way every single game, every single game. It's to the point where myself as a content creator, I've just been like, you know what? I need a fucking break. <laughs> I need a break because I already know what to expect from each game. I don't really give a fuck to give my take at this point. Y'all know what's about to happen. Y'all know Bryce gonna get tossed around. Y'all know the damn offensive line gonna get Bryce Young toe up. Our receivers gonna be looking stupid. They, it's to the point where the team's figured out if you double team Adam Thielen, they, you don't have anything else. Imagine that. You got a 33-year-old, a 33-year-old wide receiver as our number one receiver right now, who's usually supposed to be like a number three, number four slot guy, right? He's our number one. You take him out of the game, you don't have anything else. That's it, <laughs> that's it. But it's just so many issues on this offense. I'm not expecting anything different today, man. Obviously it's raining. Give Shuba the ball, you know what I'm saying? Feed our ground game, F feed our ground game. Use Blackshear, use Shuba, Miles Sanders. Feed those guys, feed those guys, keep them fresh with their legs, rotate them in and out. That's really gonna have to be the formula for today's game. Run the ball down the Falcons throat because they're gonna come with their run game too. So who's gonna run the ball better? That's really gonna be the formula for who wins today. Shout out to my brother Mojo, man, my day one. Let him know what you're thinking about today's game, man. We're gonna do what we do. Hey. We're gonna turn up, you know, and we're gonna show love to Bryce because the thing about this is, this being Bryce's first year, all we need to do is show him support, show him love, and watch what he do next year. Y'all make sure y'all do me a favor, man. Hit that like button while you are here. Subscribe if you haven't already subscribed, man. Hit the notification bell so you don't miss another video on the channel. Let's get up in this thing, man. Let's get it. Down even harder, y'all. 
first series of the offense. Let's see what these boys can do. We got to run the ball, man. Don't get cute. Run the fucking ball. Here we go. Take your time. Take your time. Bryce on the center. Hand off left. Here comes Shuba. He out. He out. First play of the game, bitch. Oh, you slow as hell, Shuba. You slow as hell, Shuba. You should have scored, man. It wasn't nothing but grand. But good shit, y'all. Good shit. All right, y'all. We got a third and two. Bryce Young back in the gun. We got a Tris bunch to the right. Bryce Young gonna hand it off. Shuba Hubbard lowers his shoulder. He's just short of the first down. But just like the Falcons did, we gotta go for it on fourth. So I'm not worried about it. Put Bryce Young back under center. Don't let them run from the shotgun, man. You can't be running from the shotgun on fourth and one. This is where we struggled all season, y'all. Fourth and one, third and one type shit. So what we need to do, get under center. Even if you want to pass out of that, fucking roll out. But of course, we in the gun, right? All right, we're in the gun. We got a trip to the right. This is going to make it harder to run if you want to go out the gut. All right, here we go. We got a motion from the slot. Handoff goes right at the middle. My point exactly. My point exactly. Why run in the gun? Why are you running from the gun if you're in four for one? Go right back on the center and hand the fucking ball off up the middle. It's not that hard, bro. It's not fucking rocket science. We're in the National Football League. Y'all should know that as coaches. You know, this team pisses me off with the offensive play calling. You know what? Hey, I'm about to go down this bitch. I'm about to tear it in the hand. Me the goddamn play calling reins. I'm about to go down this bitch. Here go third down. Plenty of time. Oh, let's go, Burns. Let's go, Burns. Oh, yeah. Oh. Oh, fuck. Oh. Yeah. Y'all see it? Yeah, they yeah. see it. Yeah. Really, nigga? <laughs> hey, real quick, man. I got to shout out the fans, bro. Y'all all some real niggas, man. For real. To, to come out here and watch this shitty team in the rain, bro. Everybody out here, you know what I'm saying, cheering and, you know what I'm saying, having a good time, bro. It, it ain't a lot of us, but shit, bro, we out here, you know what I'm saying? Only the real niggas out here, you feel me? So, hey, shout out to y'all, man. <laughs> shout out to y'all. Oh, shit, Bryce rolling out. Bryce rolling out. Oh, yeah, he got Mingo, he got Mingo. Mingo bitch ass fell on the ground, though. <laughs> so, you know, hey, shout out to the fans, man. <laughs> shout out to the <laughs> Come on, Bryce, Bryce dropping back, you got time. <laughs> Who the hell? You, uh, was you that thrown out? He could have hit Shark. He could have gave it to Shark. I mean, I, I thought that's where he was going. What the fuck was that, Bryce? You're not good, and it's okay. Get the shit together, Bryce. Come on, man. Been defending your ass all year. All right, three, third and four, man. Third and four. These niggas about to pass again, obviously. All right. Ball sales. Oh, my God. Get this little nigga off the field. This nigga is trash. Look at this shit. Second and 14. Just the theme of the whole year, y'all. Bryce Young in an empty set. Can they protect Bryce? Here we go. Watch the fuckery, y'all. Watch the fuckery. <laughs> Watch the fuckery. <laughs> All right, family. Uh, let's take a break, man. I, I, I'm Honestly, I don't give a fuck about this game. So let's go take a look at some prices around the Bank of America Stadium. All right, so we got some drinks right here, man. It's like when you first walk in, y'all see my camera, my camera a little blurry from the rain. Let's look at some prices, man. Um, you got frozen cocktails, $14.99. God damn, boy. Uh, a double souvenir cocktail is $24.49. Hell, y'all can see the prices, man. Y'all look at them yourselves. Drinks over here, expensive as shit. <laughs> so if y'all want y'all a cocktail, man, y'all got them, bring that, bring that wallet and be ready to open that pocketbook. All right, next up, y'all, we got the Mint Street Mart. Let's take, a, let's take a walk, man. Let's take a walk real quick. Let's see what these prices are talking about. Y'all walk with me real quick. It's like a little, little corner store type shit. You know what I'm saying? You come in here, grab you some gummies, grab you a bag of chips, watch the Panthers get their ass kicked. You know what I'm saying? You got, you got a whole bunch of drink selections over here. Y'all can take a look at them, man. You got some of that Twisted Tea. If you feeling like you want to goddamn bust a, a Panther fan up the side of the head because they talking silly, grab your Twisted Tea. Oh. You got some Miller Light, Bud Light, you know what I'm saying? They got plenty of selection over here. You know what I'm saying? You got all the juices and stuff that you'll see at the corner store. They got straight up Dasani. They don't have any other selection for water. So if y'all really like water drinkers like myself, don't fuck with no Dasani. But, you know, that's what they got. They got Dasani. Uh, they got some 
frozen shit over here. Got some sandwiches. So if you're looking for something cheap, cheaper than what they usually serve, what is about like $8.99? Okay. Oh, I lied, y'all. They do got more selection for water. They got smart water. Smart water going for $7, $6.99. You want a bigger one, about $8.99. So that's about $9. So yeah, man, this is the, this is the mark, y'all. This is the little corner store that, around here at the Bank of America. You check out right here. And yeah, that's the mark right here. All right, y'all, next up, we got the Uptown Mart, man. Shout out to the Uptown Market. Oh, shit, that's the exit only. I gotta go through the line, hold on. Got this big ass screen right here. Some more cocktails over there. Got a drink station over there. If you get a souvenir cup, I think the souvenir cup. We're gonna look at the souvenir cup prices, man. But if you get a souvenir cup, you can pretty much get refills all day. All right, y'all, y'all walk with me real quick. Uh, again, they got fridge, same selection that we saw in the other one. Oh shit, they got some hot stuff over here. They got the barbecue bacon dog, okay. Look like it's loaded with some with some shit on there. So you want your little hot dog real quick, you come over here, get you a Carolina dog. They got some uh something called the Georgia Peach dog. Don't ask me what's on this shit, man. I don't know, it just looks like a bunch of shit. <laughs> got you a regular hot dog. Of course, you can bring this stuff out and get some condiments and stuff. All right, thank you, ladies. I appreciate y'all. But yeah, man, shout out to the Uptown Mark. All right, y'all, you got the cooler over there. It looks like a bunch of the same shit that we really saw already. I'm not gonna go in there. That shit look a little, uh, look a little secure. But um, yeah, it look like the same shit, man. It got like the sunny water and juices and shit like that. Let's look at the spuds. Let's look at the prices with the spuds real quick. Y'all walk with me. Let's see what they talking about. Um, so the spuds look like they serving like you know loaded potatoes and shit like that. Let's see, Let's see what they talking about. You can get a large beer for uh, what, fourteen forty nine. Large domestic beer. 1349 premium beer 1149 our souvenirs okay so the souvenir cup is 899 so about nine dollars is a change if you get that souvenir cup you can come out here and get like refills pretty much they got refill stations everywhere so you get your refill if you get the souvenir cup i think that's like the best investment especially when you're gonna be here all day watching the pets get their ass beat especially when it's hot outside yeah get you a drink you know what i'm saying get you a drink get some refills and shit like that Spuds, you know what I'm saying? They're going for $13.99. You can choose your spuds. Look at the, the options. They got the chicken Philly cheesesteak, the taco, the Hawaiian barbecue pork. You know what I'm saying? Y'all can take a look at that. So yeah, man, that's the spuds. Shout out to the spuds, man. Let's keep walking. Then of course you got little stations like this that you'll see throughout the bank. Same prices really, especially like if you're trying to get a drink. Here's another drink station. Another drink station. Another little food station right here. Look like some mac and cheese. Come over here, pick up some mac and cheese, I guess. Let's look at their menu. They got three cheese, house-made mac and cheese for about $10.99. That's crazy as hell. Uh, Carolina pork, you can get Carolina pork. It's like a pulled pork sandwich for $12.99. That's about $13. You got some uh, pimento, huh? pimento cheese and bacon for $10.99. You got them more beer, you know what I'm saying? So quick little boom boom if you want something quick. You got a team store right there. We walked in there a little bit, man. A bunch of expensive shit. Nobody want to pay nothing over no damn $20 for no Panther gear. I don't know about y'all, but I'm not paying nothing for no goddamn Panther gear. That's over $20. Go in the Panther store. They've been offering a lot of discounts lately. But uh, over here, you got pizza. You got the pizza station. The beer and the drinks are also the same prices over here. You come over here, get you a pepperoni pizza for $10.49. Cheese pizza for $10.49 as well. Roasted peanuts for $5, $4.99. You got a three pack of donuts, Krispy Kreme donuts. The only donut that you should really be fucking with if you're in North, Black, North Carolina. Uh, that's $4.99, so $4.99 for a three pack of donuts. Look at this shit, look at this shit. Okay, okay, not bad, not bad. All right, let's keep walking. Here's another station, the Miller Light station. Just a bunch of beers, really. Just a bunch of selection of beer. Uh, a couple of juices here and there, I think. Oh, let me see what they're doing. Let me see what they're doing. What's the third? Third and six. Hold on. Third and six. I see this bullshit. It look like a false start. All right. Let's keep walking. <laughs> let's keep walking. Uh, let's go to Carolina Barbecue, y'all. Carolina Barbecue right up next. Let's look at their prices real quick. All right. So you got a premium loaded nachos for about $12.49. You got Carolina nachos for about $11.49. If you are wondering the difference, the premium loaded is a choice of pulled pork or chicken, nacho cheese, some pico de gallo, and some roasted corn on that bitch. 
And then uh, you got Chipotle cream and shit like that. Y'all can y'all know how to read, man. I'm not about to read this shit for y'all. You got some mac and cheese, $5.99, you know what I'm saying? You got a um, shredded barbecue chicken sandwich for $10.49. You only get the sandwich, don't, don't be asking if it come with anything, that's all you get is a sandwich. This is the stadium prices at Bank of America Stadium, shit is kind of crazy. But hey, that's what we're working with over here at the Carolinas, y'all. You got a little mini team store over here. A little mini team store over here, you know what I'm saying? Get you a, a, a Bryce Young jersey or a Miles Sanders jersey. I don't know why the fuck you would want a Miles Sanders jersey, but look, 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 they over here shitting on us. Of course, there's another Panthers punt. I don't even know what happened, but I'm, I'm assuming it's a sack. Miller Light Station again. And then of course, you can go around, you got a pretzel, hot dog, popcorn station over there. It's really, really about the same shit over there. So that's pretty much it, y'all. I mean, at least on this side where I am, that's what they got to offer as far as like food and prices and stuff like that. They got little stores and shit like that. But yeah, man, that's what they got to offer around here. Um, Prices are fucking crazy, so if you got some money to spend and you come to a game, you know, go for it, man. Me personally, man, I suggest you eat before you come here. I'm just that type of guy. I like to save money. I ain't with all that spending at the stadium type shit because these prices are crazy. Um, but yeah, that's the prices we looking at. You hungry at the game, you want to get you something to eat. Hey, by all means, go at it, man. I Sometimes I'll spend money if I'm feeling like it, you know what I'm saying, if I got it, really. But... Shit, I ate before I came. I don't need all that shit today. <laughs> Listen, if you're broke, just say that. But yeah, man, there you have it. Bank of America prices. Uh, this is that's not everything. That's not all the selection. That's at the Bank of America Stadium. Of course, you got a hole upstairs, all that shit like that. So um, yeah, man. But for the gist, the gist of it, that's pretty much what you're looking at as far as prices and uh food selection and shit like that. But one thing I do like about this stadium though uh, was the little market. I like the little markets. It's really like a little corner store type shit. You just walk in there, grab you a drink, grab you something quick to eat, some chips or something like that, munch on. Um, but yeah, that's what we got, y'all. So yeah, all right, let's get back to the fuckery. All right, here we go, y'all. Second and two, ball on the two. Can we make a stop? Cordell Patterson takes it in for the first touchdown of the game. I'm over it. I'm really over it. Watch this bullshit. Second and seven. Ball on the 43-yard line. We are in shotgun. Handoff goes to the right. Miles Sanders ran right Where did into him. Go? Where did they go? See, my thing is they give up too soon. It's like they give it like this push, and it's like a, uh, that's not football. All right, here we go. Adam Thielen got buck real quick. Third and three, ball on the 36. This is four down territory. Bryce Young, he got plenty of time. Just run, Bryce. Just fucking run, run Bryce. He got him. Good shit, Bryce. Good shit, Bryce. Here we go, baby. First down. First set of downs. Ball on the 26-yard line. Here we go. Shotgun. Bryce Young drives back again. Plenty of time. Good ball. Oh, yeah! Oh, yeah! Bryce cooking, baby. Oh, All right, y'all. I, I really don't want to see three points right here, man. We got to get on the board, bro. We got to get on the board, man. Bryce been cooking this drive. Don't waste it, man. Don't waste it, bro. We've been seeing this formation all damn game long, man. You got time, Bryce. Roll out. Roll out. Go. Run. Go. Shake his ass, Bryce. Go. God damn. You slow as shit, bro. You slow as hell, Bryce. That big ass motherfucker hawked his little ass yeah. down, too. Crazy. But it's crazy, like, nobody was fucking open either, bro. His slow ass tried to roll out. He gonna put his thumb up. What the fuck was that, Bryce? He gonna put his thumb up. What the fuck was that, Bryce? Why you put your thumb up after you just got sat? What the fuck is that? <laughs> what the fuck? This is that goofy shit I be talking about, man. This is why, I, oh my God, this team pissed me off. All right, Panther Nation, I've had enough. <laughs> We've had enough, man. Uh, it's halftime. The score is currently three to seven. Three to seven. Uh, we got close. <laughs> Same shit we've been doing, you know what I'm saying? Drive down the field and fuck it up some way, somehow. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Bryce out there running for his goddamn life. Yeah, Looking about it. slow as shit. <laughs> ball sailing every time he throw the goddamn ball. We call it stupid shit. Hey, Offensive hey. line can't protect. Yeah, the same shit. Y'all know. Y'all know how it go. Y'all know how it go, man. No separation from the receivers. Yada, yada. Same old bullshit, bro. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? It's just same old, same old. But it's just a wet game. That's it. That's the only difference. Again, only I appreciate y'all pulling up to the channel, man. As always, make sure y'all slap that like button. 
hit the notification bell so you do not miss another video on the channel i might not be dropping a lot of content again it's not a lot to talk about with the panthers it's the same shit. We, we, it's literally just been repetition <laughs> repetition every single week about the same old shit, bro um but hey shout out to the content creators man for that you know that keep going uh y'all are real ones bro you know what i'm saying shout out to my brother c dougie man i know you watching the video um shout out to you know all the other content creators man i, I can't name all y'all man it's a lot of good ones man so y'all know who y'all are man shout out to y'all and uh good luck with this content creator shit and trying to pull content out of this bullshit i'ma chill <laughs> i'ma chill i might go live here and there but you know y'all stay tuned hit that notification bell so you don't miss it man but uh i love y'all man as always stay true to yourself keep being you follow those dreams follow those dreams and the goals and go get it fam we out here we go baby to win it to win it Easy money, baby. Easy money, baby. Let's go. Yes, sir. Hey, first of all, bro, I got to apologize to my squad. Apologize to King Ice Bryce, man. Look, hey, shout out to Ice Bryce for real, bro. Hey, that last drive, that last drive was very similar to that Houston drive that we won. We drove all the way down the field, and Bryce was literally perfect. He was like 5 for 5, 68 yards, something like that. Fucking cooking, bro. That pass he had to DJ Chark. Season long. It's an opportunity. Looking for Chark. Hey, stop playing, bro. If you look, if you got doubts about Bryce, shut that shit up. I get it. We had a we had a bad season. You know what I'm saying? Bryce had some dumb shit that he did. I get it. But the flashes are there, y'all. The flashes are there. He just gave us a game-winning drive. I was even out here doubting, fam. Shout out to Ice Bryce, man. Shout out to the Carolina Panthers. Way to, look, way to fight, man. Way to fight. And look, I, I got to go back and really edit this content, man, because I was talking all kind of shit about this team. But they pulled it out at the end, bro. It was an ugly win, but we won, bro. Hey, shout out to them Panthers, man. <laughs> Keep pounding.